Hello friends, I am Sanrudra studying in class 8 in Presidency School and this is my certification for the course YouTube. So what to do? Think about the thing that you enjoy most and create a YouTube channel for the same. So um, I created my YouTube channel on all my programming and um, my hobbies. So create an intro video talking and explaining all about your channel and upload it on your YouTube channel. So this is my intro video. So this is my intro video. So then create an awesome advertisement video for your favorite brand or product and upload it on your YouTube channel. So this is my product which I have did an advertisement on. So are Arduino you know, uh, motor drivers L298 and a uh, infrared ray sensor. Uh, so this is my product and uh, this is the video here, the working of the product. So the con we are going to learn about the concepts of this line follower robot. So we place two uh, infrared ray sensors and we keep a black surface because if we keep a white surface the infrared ray sensor which produces a light gets reflected back so it senses that it's a white surface so but if we keep a black surface the infrared ray sensor would absorb the light and then it would follow the light and move on so the circuit explanation would be like the sensors be connected to the Arduino which is connected to the motor driver and then the two motors uh, are connected to the motor driver. So then we are using some batteries to charge up the Arduino. So this project can be used to follow a line in a straight way and uh, demo of how the robot had go moving. The robot would also deviate to the right side and it would move go right and turn uh, straight. And if there is a blocking path of line here, it would just stop that. Like following what works. So thanks for watching my uh, video, and you can buy the uh, other uh, objects from these um, URLs which I put here. And this is the code. So. Thanks for watching my project. If you like it, please share and subscribe. So this is my um, advertisement for my favorite product. So then, create an I mean create a video on your favorite topic or subject or hobby and upload it on your YouTube channel. So this is the video on my hobby. Friends, I'm Samuel Raj studying in class 8 in Presidency School and in 11. And this is my video on my favorite hobby, volleyball. So, the game for his classes of businessmen, which would demand less physical contact than basketball, he created the game of volleyball. 1960 in the Philippines, 
an offensive style of passing the ball in a high trajectory to be struck by another player or uh, with the mid um uh, so myself from behind yeah, uh, the straining line um to the end line until after contact ball may be served underhand or overhand ball must be clearly visible to opponents serve must be returned by a bump only no setting or attacking a serve into the fight and uh, if the if both of them have 24 and 24 points then the game will go on to 26 points so who scored with two points there are the winners continuously Who scores two points continuously are the winner there. So this is rotation. A team will rotate each time they win the serve. Players on each side. So each side should have six players actually, but here it's given four to six as it was an old way of playing. You play in your game. So a maximum of three hits per side. Player may block is not considered as a hit. See, ball may be played off the net during a volley and on serve. Playing the game again, okay. a legal hit is contact with the ball by a player body above and including the waist, which does not allow the ball to visibly come to a rest. So, if two or more players contact the ball simultaneously, it is considered one play. The players involved may not participate in the next play. Failure to serve the ball over the net successfully. Hitting the ball illegally, carrying, if you carry the ball and it's a foul, or if you're palming it, it's a foul, or throwing it, it's a foul. Um, when blocking a ball, which is in the opponent's court but is being returned, the blocker must not contact the ball until after the opponent is attempting to return the ball. So the playing area is given here. Chess, so it's four one by eight inch. The height of the net shall be eight feet. So, so this is the end of the my presentation. So, thanks for watching my project. If you like, please subscribe and share. So, I have uploaded the three videos. So so I I can sh so this I've showed you how to go to my channel so as you go to YouTube this will be the home page you get so click on the icon your Gmail icon here and click on your channel uh, so you will get all the channels you have uploaded so explain and show all the three videos you made and uploaded on your channel in brief so i have done that and save this recording as video and upload it on with junior's project page so uh, and then features you must use you need to create one youtube channel i have done that you need to create three mentioned video and upload the same on your channel so i have done that each of the three videos should be more than 5 minutes so i have done that and record your screen face and audio with screencast automatic so i have done that and you must explain and show your channel and the videos that you uploaded so i did that so this is my uh, youtube channel project so thanks for watching my project see you again in wish juniors